welcome to Game and Wife. Yeah, welcome back to Game and Wife. Uh, we're, we're playing Kingdom Hearts. Um, starting a new game today. Starting a brand new game, and I'm post-dating this video because uh, in, in time of recording. But uh, happy anniversary, honey. Happy anniversary, baby. Yeah. Um, the 14th is our uh, five-year wedding anniversary, and I thought that uh, we should upload it on our anniversary. Yep. And this is a wonderful anniversary gift that you let me play my one of my favorite games Absolutely. on our on our YouTube channel. Absolutely. And that's the way it should be. I'm actually quite spoiled. Realistically, you've let me play almost all of my favorite games on our YouTube channel. Ocarina of Time, Adventure Island, our one shot, now yeah. Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts, yeah. Just cuz uh, Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to be I've coming been having these weird thoughts lately. That's um Oh gosh, what's that? Kid's name. The kid's name? Yeah. Sora? Like, yeah. Yes. No, I mean, what's the actor's name? Oh, the voice actor? Haley uh, Joe Osment. Haley Joe Osment, yep. Yep. I have no idea when this game came out. I I really literally oh, know nothing about this. It was 2005, maybe, 2004. I don't even know. We have the box somewhere. <laughs> Man, oops, that was oops, one oops. heck of a trip. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> It's like, Sora, are you daydreaming? 2002. 2002. Yep. Okay. According to the box. The music is uh, pretty catchy. Mm-hmm. Like, um, dude, there's a wave coming. I don't care. <laughs> Unless that's a girl. That's not a girl, is it? No, that's, uh, that's Riku. That's a boy. Riku. Yeah, so I was like, I'll save you. And he's like, I'm good. <laughs> Look at those boots. Look at those clown shoes. I know, he's got huge feet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that means he has big feet. The That's soundtrack was recorded by... um. Oh, oh my gosh, why is my brain so farty? The Japanese-American singer. Okay. Um, I have her CDs. Oh my gosh. On the iTunes. Kesha? No, it's not, not Kesha. <laughs> That's, that was just silly what you said. <laughs> oh, it's going to drive me nuts. Um, that girl's really skinny. Yep. I mean, that's Kyrie. Kyrie. Mm -hmm. And what is is that uh, Sora's girlfriend? Oh, look, it's uh, Sora's clone falling from the sky. <laughs> what happened? I am. Am I falling up? Am I falling down? I am like super confused on what is happening. I think he's going through a, a type of hallucinogen. <laughs> he's which, dreaming. <laughs> which we don't condone. This is one heck of an intro. Oh, he's... Back in the water. Back in the water. Apparently he's like an Italian plumber. Can breathe underwater. <laughs> so that's always good. Yeah, I'm going completely fresh in this game. I have n I've never that's played true. it. That's true. You've never played this game. But uh, Bess is going to be starting playing first, so I can kind of get the gist on... Actually, I mean... when you and I very, very first started dating, I mean, we were... We barely knew each other. Okay. I played this game with you. Well, you didn't play. <laughs> I played it and let you watch. Because <laughs> I'm nice like that. I think you were playing the second one. I think it was the... Oh, maybe it was. I don't even remember. Sn and Sn Snow White and the, hun and the Huntsman. That's what that was. Oh! You see Link from... Z <laughs> oh! So little time. These are the facts. I think we, that should be like people that we work with. People are just so frustrated about stuff. <laughs> it's like, just don't be afraid. Just take your time. And I'll step forward and you can do it. I can do it. I, I use the left analog stick. Tilt slightly to walk? Yeah, like that. Look at that little John. Like he's uh, like kind of a pompous. Look at my big feet. <laughs> bam, 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 bam. You'd walk funny too if you had giant feet like that. If I had clown feet. All right, so this is our first decision that we have to make in the game. Okay. Oh, sweet, a sword. We have to decide. Okay. We have to choose our weapon. Press circle to jump. Later on. I think <laughs> what an that. unusual jump. <laughs> I can jump. <laughs> All right. All right, what's this do? I'm a shield. Oh, it's like a Mickey Mouse shield. Yep, so there's a shield. Okay. Or there's a sword. A sword, or... Or there's a magic wand. Oh. What you choose in the beginning of the game starts your stats. Okay. So do you want to be attack heavy? 
defense heavy, or magic heavy? Oh gosh, I'll let you pick. Is that what you usually pick? No, I've always usually picked the shield. In we're going to read all the little descriptions a here. Staff of wonder and ruin. Is this power you seek? I don't know yet. I think it should be narrated by Droopy because he's not a Disney character. <laughs> and I'm definitely going to do that too. <laughs> the power of the warrior. Invincible courage. A sort of terrible destruction. <laughs> <laughs> Is this the power that you want, or whatever? <laughs> Let's read the shield. I think the reason I picked the shield in the past was because, um, it can be used as a weapon and as a shield. Ah, well, that's it. <laughs> Too bad that can't be, like, in Legend of Zelda. Right. Where you could just beat someone to death with a, with a shield. So what do you think? Let's pick the shield, I guess. Alright. Your path is set- Oh! Look at that spiky hair. Our story begins. <laughs> yeah, this is this is where our story begins. There's a little... What is that? Fable 2? Yeah. So now we have to give something up in exchange for our power. I guess this, the, the, the sword, then. You want to give up the sword? I imagine the sword to be, like, the evil thing, because you can, like, like cut people in half and stuff. It's I know kinda it's... Like, yeah, it's kind of like wisdom, power, and courage, I think, like... The shield is like courage, the the staff is like wisdom, and the shield is like power. Or the sorry, the sword is like power. Okay. I think I said that backwards. No, I get I totally understand. Power of the warrior, invincible courage, a sword of terrible destruction. Make sure to run real fast with it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll give up the power of the Go sword. time, go time, let's go! <laughs> so we're the guardian, and we've given up the power of the warrior. It's okay, we still kick a lot of ass in this game. Okay. So are we good with that decision? Let's do it. Let's yeah. do it. All right, let's get to playing the game. <laughs> yeah, we've been... The whole first episode will be spent picking the Seven minutes the in, and we're uh, like, do I want the sword, do I want the shield, or do I want the jogging pants that uh, allows me to move swiftly through the, the, the breeze of the water? Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I'm making stuff up. Yeah. They're comfortable, yet effective. Yeah. They're slimy, yet satisfying. <laughs> Which is another Disney reference, yeah. Well, we, I think we get to visit the Pride Lands. Yeah, it is this one. We get to visit the Pride Lands. Is that Cinderella? Yep, Rindersella. <laughs> <laughs> and her three sad blisters. Uh, and her three sad blisters. You gain the power to fight. almost said flight. Alright, press X to attack. Oh man, now now we look weird. Maybe we should, we should have picked the sword. No, it's okay. Okay. We don't keep the shield. Use the power to protect yourself and others. The green gauge displays your health. Hit points, traditional stuff. Standard upper. Use your magic. Now, what Pokemon do you get to choose? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. We've got uh, Death uh, Death Charmander and Death Pikachu and. Yeah. Oh my. I'll fight you. What are those green things? Those are HP. Those are hit points? Does that, does that refill your health? It refills your HP, yeah. Okay. Look at those bright yellow shoes. Sora is the main character's name? You, you, yeah. Okay, you're playing Sora. I'm playing a Sora. Um, he is definitely not uh, accessorizing. Who wears yellow shoes with, with red shorts? <laughs> he lives on an island, man. He doesn't have access to Behind you. fashion. Look, turn around, man! You Generally. automatically target the nearest target. Press R1. Okay. R1. To lock on to enemies. Lock on. Oh, my gosh. I, we probably could have skipped all this. I'm sorry, everyone. But I have never seen this. I don't know what to expect, so I'm going in completely fresh. So if you've seen this before or have done it like hundreds of thousands of times, forget it. I need this for XP. Ah... <laughs> uh. I can't imagine being beaten to death with a with a shield. So like, oh, I had to beat him to death with his own with shoes. His own shoes. So they got their one thousand pounds of being on M&Ms to fill a brandy glass. You will enjoy the dark side, Sora. Come to the dark side. Oh, wouldn't that be so cool? And, and if if they did a Kingdom Hearts three, which I know they're going to, obviously, but if there was like a Star Wars area or something because you know mm. Disney Disney owns Star Wars now 
Oh my gosh, that would be so cool. It's going to be awesome. And even in the second one, they adapted some worlds that were really cool and, and not really visited, like the Tron world is in the second one. That was when Tron Legacy had come out, but it's an original Tron. Oh, Tron. I never saw... I have actually have never seen the original Tron movie. That's crazy. So whenever a question mark pops up against something that you can walk up to, it means you can examine it. So you can look at it or, or okay. touch it or interact with it. Okay. So you can lock on to it. Okay. And then you can use X to examine it. Or in this case, just bad. Oh, I'm sorry. No, you gotta you gotta use your little menu thingy here, which is the D-pad. Oh my gosh. Okay. And examine. You get used to that, I promise. I can't open it. Clearly, I can go around it, but I can't. <laughs> if I can't go through the dude. No, oh, it's over here. You got the master sword. <laughs> Man, that's what Link should have done in Legend of Zelda. Just knock on all the chests instead of waiting. Yeah, right. Like, you can push large crates. Like, hello! I'm here to explore. And you use... I don't know if you can... You can't see me, honey, but... Yeah. Uh, well, they can't see me. You use R1 and R2 for your cameras. You mean L2 and R2? I'm just saying it backwards. L2 and R2. What did I say? That's what you said, but I'm <laughs> just being... You said L... I think you said L1. I don't care. But... You, you can smash! Turn. Which I'm gonna. Just... Yeah, and I got a potion. Oh, so it's it's kind of like Pokemon. The yeah, but you stuff. have access to everything like right on your screen. So it's not like it's turn based or anything. Yeah, lock down. Donkey Kong L2. just bursts out of the barrel like. <laughs> All right, so you lock on and then you use L2 to switch between your lockdown targets. So we are learning the basics here, folks. Yep. But maybe we'll, maybe we can make this one like a. Like a Game & Wave preview episode. I, maybe, yeah. I mean, I'm still going to upload it, you know, because it's our, it's our anniversary. And uh, at, at, um, I'm post-dating this uh, video. Uh, we're actually going out of town for our anniversary. So. Yep. We're getting out of Dodge for a little bit. <sighs> it's so bright. It's very bright. <laughs> <laughs> Look at his blue eyes. They're, they're almost too blue. You know where they're like, oh, that's oh, that's photoshopped, and that's photoshopped, and a white screen won't won't open just yet. First, tell me about yourself. Select to shift. Oh, you can do, make this first person. No okay. way. Press select again. Okay. You can't like move though. I mean, it's just to look around. Oh, it's like your in look. Zelda. It's your look button. Yeah. Okay. That would have been cool in the Resident Evil. I've actually been really getting back into the Resident Evil games. And it's... What's most important to you? Friendship, probably, hey? Friendship is rare. Know what I'm saying to you. Friendship is rare. Yeah, it is. It's like, Listen, what would you say is most important? What do you want out of life? <laughs> These are super philosophical questions. It sets your stats for the game. It's okay. important. Okay. Um, I guess to broaden my horizons. Oh, man. I know why I married you. You picked the same ones I would pick. What's really? this dude want? What are you so afraid of? Um, being indecisive, I would say. Okay. Um, I, I, I think I'm uh, being indecisive. Whoa, that looks like his brother. <laughs> like, <laughs> sort of a, hey, bro. Uh, what do you want out of life? Um, like... The cereal life? Or? <laughs> <laughs> I, well, I like the cinnamon kind. Cinnamon's good. And I, li I like the sugar out of the bottom of the box, but I don't want the mushy bowl of cereal that comes with oh, it. Oh, God, that's the worst. It is. I hate mushy cereal. Hey, so speaking of cereal, what do you think about this whole like cereal milk thing? What do you mean cereal milk thing? People who make desserts out of cereal milk. Oh, yeah, cereal milk. I forgot about For people that don't know what cereal milk is, basically this person... I remember seeing a video or something where all they do is they put cereal into a bowl and then, you know, add milk. And then they use their hands to toss the cereal with the milk. Yep. Dump out all the cereal, and then you have, like, the sugary... It's like sweet milk. Right, like when you drink the milk at the end of a bowl of cereal. That's the best part. But they use it to make, like, milkshakes and... Oh, God. That just... That kind of sickens me a little bit. Sleeping Beauty? And her wicked mm -hmm. flying stepsisters? I'm going to tell you right now, there are a lot of Disney films I have not seen. So I'm not going to know everyone's name. To open the menu screen? In the main menu, you can do all sorts of stuff. 
but you can't open it. You All can right. purse. Yeah, during battle it just pauses you. Okay. And during cutscenes, you can't open your menu. Can you skip cutscene? Wow, he's really flat. Oh, there he is. There he is. Now he's gonna go. Now it's holy cow. There's a lot more of these things than I thought. Mm -hmm. Take him down. Yeah. I'm on it. He's just so like. Sora is so charismatic. Like he's so he knows what he's what he wants out of life. Cause he just talked to three people about being philosophical. Like, what do you want out of life? God, I, you know what? I can't remember. Or, <laughs> I don't know what uh, T-shirt I'm gonna wear for the day. Well, considering he's only got one outfit, I think he's got it figured out. Oh, come on, you bugger! Come out of the ground. There we go. Let me get all these heat. All these green these gemmies. Green orbies. Jimmy. He has ascended into heaven. <laughs> it's it's like old man Obi Wan Kenobi. Like, Obi Wan. All right, a save point. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Now, when you walk into a save point, yeah, you it automatically refills your health and your HP and MP. Mm. And you don't have to save to do that. You just have to stand in it long enough for it to heal you. Okay. And save a lot. It's just a good rule of thumb in a game that has limited save points. Save, save as much as you freaking can. Well, it's not like, it's not like, whoa! The Rainbow Road! Yeah, right? Get your Mario Kart out. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that's actually pretty. Should I we hope... save? Uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and save, and, uh, we're gonna see what's up those stairs next time. Boop! Boop! Yeah. yeah. Alright. Next time on Game & Wife, stick around... Like, comment, subscribe, all that Facebook stuff we talk about all the time, ad nauseum. See you next time. All right. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> all right, bye, guys. Bye.